write the completely factored form of f of x. Here we are given that f of x is equal to 6x to the fourth minus 29x cubed minus 271x squared plus 309x plus 945. Wow. Fortunately, we're told some other information. We're told that the function has zeros of negative 5, negative 3 halves, 7 thirds, and 9. It's a good thing we have that information because trying to factor that polynomial would be difficult to say the least. So we have a theorem or a property that tells us that if k is a zero of a polynomial, then x minus k is a factor of the polynomial. So we have a zero. Let's compare the zero and the factors. A zero of negative five. That means we have a factor of x minus negative five, which we will write as x plus five. We have a zero of negative three halves, so we'll write that as x well, you can say it's x minus negative 3 halves, which we write as x plus 3 halves. We have a 0 at 7 thirds, so that means we have a factor of x minus 7 thirds. And we have a, fa a 0 of 9, which means we have a factor of x minus 9. So then we have four factors. So we can say that f of x is equal to, let's just multiply out the factors. We would have x plus 5, x plus 3 halves, x minus 7 thirds, and x minus 9. But if we were to multiply that whole thing out, we would have an x to the fourth power, and we need a 6x to the fourth power. So what we do now is we put that 6 out in front, and that is the completely factored form of the polynomial.